how that worked out. So as you can see, not too bad. Uh, works out pretty efficient. Obviously the, you know, the last board's always tough because you want to be more conservative. I don't want to be cutting the, uh, the actual skid but I think this should work out good so let's process this pile and then we'll uh we'll tune back in when we get back on the Kubota and we lift the big sections out of the trailer but as you can see it's working pretty good shouldn't take long to uh fill this shed these are all three feet so pretty cool hours time of loading up this hodgepodge pile by hand nevertheless onto the jig and half an hour we got this much so where we're going next uh, probably next video we're gonna fill this one up but we're gonna load the full length cutoffs onto this and see how it works that way so I hope you guys uh, hope you guys think it's interesting as you can see there's a little discrepancy between each piece but each piece is about three feet long which is perfect for the boiler so we'll mix it in with you know various hardwoods and other stuff so I'm very very happy Answer the question does the saw jig cut yes it does it cuts very efficiently as you can see all i'm left here is uh all i'm left here is the cutoffs the pieces that really kind of fell through the cracks but anyways a couple improvements i might um i might trim these it's a little awkward these are a tad bit tall to try to maneuver so i might cut these all flush here going down i don't need that much yield 
Uh, I'd rather make it a little bit easier to move, but uh, also improvements, I may put some plywood here, but then again, I'll lose the fact of the trash falling through. So actually, I'm just gonna leave it this way. I might trim this, I don't know, but anyway. All right, so this is what we got done. And I don't really keep track of time, but we still have about a half a trailer load left um, to cut up, but it filled up uh, half that shed. That's pretty good. There's all kinds of heat in there. As you can see, they're not perfect pieces, but works out pretty good. We have the jig loaded up with one more round, but uh, I had to stop uh, cutting wood because we had a visitor. <laughs> My little boy woke up from his nap here. But anyways, uh, I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, I work around his nap schedule, so things don't move too, too fast around here, but it's okay, with, uh, it's okay by me. But uh, anyways, I appreciate you guys watching. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Like I said, the jig worked. Uh, jig works pretty good. We got uh, probably about half a trailer load left, so we're gonna actually set up. We're gonna move back. We're gonna move the jig back a little bit and start filling this woodshed. So maybe we'll, you'll see that in the next video. Who knows? We got all kinds of stuff going on. But anyways, can you say thanks for watching? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching guys. I appreciate it and we'll see you on the next one.